Hey, how's it going? Chris here in the garage. Going to do a, a little morning video, talk about a few things. It has been very, very dry here in central Oklahoma, and they're predicting some weather for tomorrow and this weekend. And of course, when you get weather, it's going to be, you know, probably severe. That's what they're saying on the TV. It's been about, what, 40 days since we've had appreciable rain. But the good thing is with the sun, so I'm making some darn good power, 24 plus kilowatt hours yesterday on the system. So I'm not complaining there at all. All right, the other thing is on my YouTube channel, just went over 4,000 subscribers. Been at YouTube for about three years. I just want to thank everybody for subscribing and for all the new subscribers. Um, try to make some good video for you. Show you some do-it-yourself stuff here. And uh, here's one thing I wanted to show you guys in the morning. It's kind of a um, follow-up on this refrigerator down here. It's converted from a deep freezer. To be quite honestly, I should have done this a long time ago. This thing is running very, very well with this digital thermostat down here set on 34 degrees. I also have an internal thermostat wireless in there too, just to kind of keep an eye on things. Uh, one th real quick thing is that I'm going to use this refrigerator as my sticker board, YouTube channels and stuff. And the first one that I have to show is Wyatt One Able on YouTube. I'm subscribed to his channel and I sent him a sticker, so he sent me back a sticker. Really enjoy his videos in his shop. So head on over to Wyatt One Able and check out his channel. All right, let's look inside. One thing I did is I hard mounted this light right here. Very, very happy with that. But this thing has been running flawlessly. And I put a little stand for this milk crate right here to hold this up. But I just go to the uh, store and I like the old school bottles because you can pick a bottle right here like it is. And I hooked up a little old school can opener. There you have it. <laughs> Good stuff. My mail guy dropped off, uh, my, my, I was out here in the garage and he came up with some stuff and Got talking with him. He's a uh, Army and Air Force veteran. And I said, hey man, you thirsty? Want a Coke or something? And uh, he said, sure. So, and it was hot as all get out yesterday. So he came in and we just shot the stuff there, talking about all kinds of stuff. You know, his time in, my time in. And uh, drinking a Coke and chillaxing for a little bit. And then he got in his uh, mail van and took off. So I said, hey man, if you want something cold, I mean, you know, those those trucks that they deliver mail in are not air conditioned. And when you're out delivering mail, I man, he just, whew, talk about a weight loss program, I guess. Uh, but uh, he was very appreciative of uh, getting an ice cold 34 degree bottled drink here. I think he got a, yeah, he drank a Coke and I grabbed a Fanta. But uh, let me show you the uh, wireless up here. This is the sensor that's inside the uh, conversion. But overall, this thing has just been running stupid excellent. Love it, love it, love it. Ice, ice cold. And you can still tap it down to be a deep freezer too if you want to use it as a deep freezer too. You probably notice in the other video so I've got an actual CO2 fire extinguisher, which is really, really good for electronics in case something happens. And I'm not going to get into what happened before, but I will never use a chemical 
agent on my electronics again it was a big freaking mess when I did have a issue and had to use a fire extinguisher okay and then one quick last thing with the truck here I'm gonna be doing some road trips here uh, maybe next week uh, I got one buddy that's gonna be out and about and I have to watch his house and animals in the same token he watches my house and animals so I'm just waiting for him to let me know what he wants to do but before I go on this journey I'm not telling you where I'm gonna get a mirror mirror dash cam it's one of those clip-on mirror deals with two cameras on the side right here I think it's the Falcon 360 plus is what I've been doing research on so what I'll be able to do is I'll have a front-facing camera so you can see what's going on there then one camera will be faced on me so I can narrate at the same time I think it'd be really cool um, kind of enhance safety and security and and show you a little bit of uh, <laughs> some of the stupid drivers I guess is what I would also be able to capture too because there's a plenty of them on the roads today oh yeah and one other thing I need to consider is I helped a buddy mix up some concrete right and I used my Dewalt drill over here and this is just a 3 8 inch chuck no big deal DCD 771 but uh, I think I almost killed it it still works but uh, I'm going to need to consider getting a, um, you know, I like the 20 volt system, getting a um, half inch drive chuck with a brushless. So let me take a look at these uh, 4th of July sales coming up soon. So, all right, there you have it. I didn't want this to be a long video, but, you know, it's kind of nice to go out here in the garage and talk to you guys in the morning and share with you some of the things that I do and what's about to happen and what's going to happen. So, all right. Talk to you later. Let's hope we get some rain. <laughs>